Hey guys, we're back on the Nova Show. It's your host, International Nova. And before we get started, I want to give you guys a heads up. Going forward on a weekly basis, I will be adding a spotlight feature to the Nova Show. Now, all you have to do is drop a link in the comments below with some of your original music, and me and my team will go ahead and take a listen to it. And if we like it, feature you on the Nova Show. Now, some of you guys have been dropping links. We have been checking them out. And pretty soon, we'll determine who our first feature will be. Now with that being said, let's go ahead and get to the music news. Tupac is alive. Well, according to a retired police officer, David Myers, in a deathbed confession, he stated that he was paid $1.5 million by Tupac to help stage or fake his death. Now according to Officer Myers, he did state other people were also paid off and some of these include doctors, nurses, and other police officers. Now some of you guys may have seen an autopsy picture of Tupac floating around on the internet. Well, according to David Myers, this person was actually a body double that was paid $50,000 to pose as Tupac in the morgue. Now over the years, there have been many theories regarding Tupac and his death, and if this story is true, it can be a huge bombshell. Now in other news, it looks like a platinum album is not the only thing that rapper J. Cole has earned this year. Now J. Cole has just completed his third leg of his tour, and according to Billboard, in the last three months, has gained over $16.4 million while on tour. Now I don't know about you guys, but I'm a huge fan of the TV show Empire. Now the show made a season debut Wednesday night, and it crushed the ratings, with over 16 million viewers watching the show. Now according to reports, the premiere easily outdid anything on TV this past week, and we're all wondering what's gonna happen next. Now how many of you guys actually took Kanye West seriously at the VMAs when he stated he was running for president? According to a recent interview with Vanity Fair, Kanye stated that the year 2020 is the year for his presidency. Now in video game news, pro skater Tony Hawk has dropped his brand new game, Tony Hawk Pro Skater 5. Now one of the few surprises in the game is Lil Wayne. Yes, Lil Wayne is actually a character in the video game. Now this is actually pretty cool and I may have to take a stab at this game and check out Lil Wayne's gameplay. Now in other news, Pandora has just announced that over the past 10 years, it has paid out over $1.5 billion in royalties to musicians and labels. Now as a side note, Pandora has paid over $500 million in royalties in just the last 12 months. Now that's it for the Nova Show and today's music news. Until next time, you guys take care. <laughs> I'll be that ghost in the night time. Soon as young man get ghost, I'll be that lifeline. And I'm growing up, since you were